Hey guys, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you a quick little tutorial on how to set up the lightweight NetSurf browser. So to start off, open up a terminal window. Once you've got that open, you can, if you're using Ubuntu, I should say, Ubuntu is the distribution we will be covering in this video because most people are gonna be using Ubuntu or something based off of it. From there, you can do apt search NetSurf, you know, maybe you don't know what the package is. You see there are a bunch of different packages. There's FB, NetSurf GDK, there's all this. What you wanna do is you wanna just do sudo apt install NetSurf for the basic browser. If you want alternatives, you can install the other ones. But uh, I would just recommend installing the NetSurf package. After that, enter your password and you can press Y to start up. You can also, if you wanna install it through the Ubuntu Software Center, you can just launch that and do it that way. But once it's open, you can open up the application and go under Internet Net Surf. Now from here, we can go over a little bit how the browser work and set up the settings. So if you want to access your bookmarks or set them up, you won't be able to import them, sadly. I don't know what that deal is, but if you want to access the existing bookmarks, you can click the Show Bookmarks button in Navigate. And if you want to add something, you can just click Add to Bookmarks or Alt-D, Control-D, I mean. If you want to configure your privacy, you can go to the edit menu, click on preferences, and then from there, find the privacy tab. Now from here, you can see, you know, I've already got them enabled, so do not attract, referral submission, and that will allow you to, you know, do not track is the main one, so enable that. You can close that. Now if you want to set up pop-up blocking, once again, edit menu, preferences, go to content, select the prevent pop-up windows. And if you want to block ads, just click hide adverts. Now for JavaScript, this is again in the content tab, you want to check the enable JavaScript button. Now for some reason JavaScript is turned off and I know that's probably for privacy reasons, but honestly most of the web relies on JavaScript and if you want to have a prayer in using it as, you know, if you, want to, if you want to use this browser as a browser, you need that enabled. Now, if you want to set your home page, look for the main area right here. Sorry. Now, type in your home page. So for here, it's going to be my browser of choice, my uh, search browser of choice. And uh, it'll go to there if I press home. Or, or close, one of the two. Anyways, that is how you can set up the NetSurf web browser. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next one.